My third point is Islamophobia. There are 1.3 billion Muslims in this world. There are millions of Muslims living in, in other countries, European countries and the US as minorities. But Islamophobia is creating a division. Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, there is no other Islam. On this day, March 15, 2022, United Nations General Assembly approved a resolution setting March 15. As the International Day to Combat Islamophobia, presented by ex-Pakistan's Prime Minister Imran Khan. Imran Khan has welcomed the decision of United Nations General Assembly. I feel honored today to represent my country. To approve the resolution and setting March 15th as the International Day to Combat Islamophobia. The resolution adopted on Tuesday, March 16, 2022 by 193 member world body and co-sponsored by 55 mainly Muslim countries emphasizes the right to freedom of religion and belief and recalls a 1981 resolution calling for the elimination of all forms of intolerance and discrimination based on religion or belief. In a tweet on Tuesday, March 16, 2022 evening, Khan congratulated Muslims around the world as our voice against the rising tide of Islamophobia has been heard. Today, UN has finally recognized the grave challenge confronting the world of Islamophobia. My third point is Islamophobia. There are 1.3 billion Muslims in this world. There are millions of Muslims living in, in other countries, European countries and the US as minorities. But Islamophobia is creating a division. Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, there is no other Islam. Respect for religious symbols and practices and of curtailing systematic hate speech and discrimination against Muslims, Khan posted. He further added, next challenge is to ensure implementation of this landmark resolution. <laughs>